I like you. You want to go get some burger shot? There he is. Stevie, dump the car. I'll take this piece of ass. Guys, the beach better be worth the trouble. The pa's got some serious cash. And he pissed off Gerald. That's reason enough for me. Well, he better pay quick. I hate to think of the fight she'll put up if you try to cut her fingers off. Okay. I think because we turned down the radio, we don't hear the music. Yeah. Gracefully taken. <laughs> Wait. Gordon has the bitch. The I'm done with her. Yes. Thanks, Nico. My brother will be a happy because man. All the radio I'll get things in motion. Be in touch. Because they, no. all, they lost the licenses. And I think if you turn down the radio music, you it don't turns get, down the soundtrack. It, turn, oh. it, it turns down the, the music in. Darn it! Ah! Uh. Cool. Do, 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 do. That's, that's about it. Mm -hmm. Man, well, I kind of want to do that. Yeah, well, we can't because. Makes sense. YouTube will fuck us up the ass. Well, since I don't want to, I'm just gonna take two taxis back. And plus, it's a lot easier to just have them off. Whistle! Come on! Bitch. I must have I gone invisible. Yeah. Okay. The, what? Someone in that. I'm robbing you. I don't want to kill you. <laughs> he doesn't even care. Oh, you don't want to go. <laughs> so, man, where you want to go, huh? <coughs> hey, I don't care who's in my taxi as long as they're paying. <laughs> Here we are. Thank you. Oh, it's this one. Man, would you guys want to go to a fast food joint that's on Times Square? What's up, Bernie? I wanted to give you something to say thank you for me and Bryce. Well, he doesn't know I'm giving you this, but he gave it to me, so it's technically from him. What is it? This car. Enjoy! I only power walk or take cabs, so I figured I should pass this on to my savior. Thanks, man. I appreciate that. Don't mention it. What we've got is worth more than money. <laughs> Hello, welcome to Clocking Bell. How hey. can I help you? I don't know. I'll bring Crane to go pick it up, I guess. Here. All cock, no ball. <laughs> God. Oh, yeah. Right. Goodbye. Welcome to Clocking Bell. Wow, oh, that hurt. Hurt. Welcome to Clocking Bell. All cock, no ball. You! You want to die? You don't have to put a wig for me. Oh, whatever. Yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll do it anyways. Because Bernie Crane will be an option. But that's not what I wanted. <gasps> the judge will be more lenient if you come out. No, no, just, just take it, take it, whatever. Okay, I'm doing this. Police, get down! down. This is well, yeah. what was a waste? Wow, yeah. that was a huge ass waste. <laughs> Man, we try to destroy this now. No, that's illegal. Just let them kill you. Get into a taxi now!
get some dick. That, he, that almost reminded me of a death from Hitman 2 where he's like struggling to get up, but then he just falls I don't lose all my guns, do I? Which no, one? you're good. No. Hitman 2. Oh, like an animation from... Like when you die in Hitman 2. Oh, one Agent 47. Yeah. I thought you were talking about... <laughs> no, he's just like... Ugh. Oh, yeah. Yo! In like Hitman Blood Money, I think, you're allowed to... Uh, when you're dead, you have like 10 seconds. So we need to go to Beaverhead Avenue. Okay then, here we go. I need some grub. Same. Yeah. We can probably take them up. Let's run for a few minutes. So Nicky, you and the pack is getting close, they think. He's got work. He pays. That's about it. Yeah? Well, remember who made the introduction. Remember who brought you in, don't you forget about me. If you want to pass something up to me, pay me some tribute. Sorry, Ray, I'm freelance. I don't buy into that tribute stuff. This work has many disadvantages, but uh, hey, at least it's tax free. Jesus. You didn't drop it down my toilet, did you? I think that's exactly what I did. <laughs> hey! Uh, who you waving at? Feds, I think. They always drive past it this oh. time. Does that worry you? <laughs> when you marry a dragon, you gotta expect a few knights are gonna turn up to try to <laughs> slay him. Jackasses, all of them, all of you. <laughs> nice talking with Whatever. you. Whatever. You have fun. Pick a swell guy to kill. Hopefully someone with a young family who really miss him. Hey! Hey! Is Mr. Pegorino around? Uh, uh, sure. I I'll get him. Boss! Anthony, will you shut up? In fact, will you fuck off? Go on, get out of here. <laughs> Don't come back till you get a brain implant or something. I'm sorry. I I'm s nice to see you, Nico. You too. I got a couple of things I want to talk to you about. First up, can you kill this shithead? Sure. <laughs> Second, come in. Yeah, <laughs> Just short. <laughs> so, listen, we got a bit of a problem with the Pavanos. Yes, I noticed that that you're meeting with them. The way they look at us, we're bottom feeders. Always have been. We ain't a real family to them. Just a bunch of Guernsey Goombas. When things are cool, we're getting fucked. I'm sorry to hear that. Uh, sure. Listen, some of their boys are in town today. Gonna collect that piece of an old and a bookie ring. Where it is, they're at the diner, an actor. Find them, and follow them to the meet. You disrupt it, and I'll let you keep the money. But make sure you hit the Pavanos real hard! Gabish? Oh, I got yeah. the camera Gabish. <laughs> Thank you. Gives it the scene a little oomph. You know, oomph. Yeah. It's very is that demanding, even a word, or is it just a... Oomph? Oomph, oomph, oomph. Well, it's not a word. Shut the fuck up. We're so stupid. Leave a like and comment. Don't forget to check that bell icon. Don't forget that also my merch. I just put a strap on in the fucking store. How about I am worthless? Or how about you just watch it and if you enjoy it, then that's great. So make sure to buy Raid Shadow Legends. We're That's just here right. to hang out, right? We're just yeah. hanging out. No, we're sponsored by um, I don't know, the game, game, Rattle, 
Oh my god. Think of this like a podcast format where yeah. there's a game we're playing in the background and we only occasionally react to what's happening on screen. I know. <laughs> okay. Uh, was this game drums? Discount game drums? Uh, yes. Game, uh, except Game Drums only does like 10 minute videos. So. Yeah, we, we, we're better. We, we, we do 30 minute content. videos. We give you three times the content. <laughs> three times the content. <laughs> <laughs> we're also not even a quarter at least funny of them. Uh uh. But we try, uh -huh. and that's what matters. Hey, at least we're, we're, our at least we're post ironic. Oh, yeah. Which we need to start that. Yes. We're just hanging I think in that real guy life? works for the Pegorinos. God, they must be desperate. Let's lose them on the way to the meet. Huh. Oh, really? Why am I face backwards? For now. Oh, for now, okay. We got a new <coughs> Phil. Phil mission. Phil boy. Two options, Bernie or Phil. Bernie's on a mission though, it's just a car, getting a car, right? Yeah. Has the icon though. Mm -hmm. yeah. 
Ciao bella! I got that stuff, Jimmy. Well done, my boy! I hope you made him suffer. Gave some that more than his Pecorino curve. Is there a nice little haul in it for you? All right. Well, maybe you'll give me a little taste of it. Can't soak it up the last. Half hour with Italians been doing things for centuries. Good thing I'm not Italian. My car! It's not even my car. I stole it. This car. It's not mine. Come on! Ooh, little Jacob Port. <laughs> Malik, I want to introduce you to John Gravelli, head of the Gambetti family. He needs help. I'm already working for a mafia family. They're scum. Pegorino? They're not a family. Gravelli is the only man who can get what you need done. He's in Shotla Medical Center. Tell him you were sent by a mutual friend. He's expecting you. Hey, fuck, I got no short-term memory. Come on, get going. Great, now I have another... Oh, what the hell? <laughs> that was cinematic. <laughs> Sorry, badass. Cash list only. Hey, Tommy, check this out. Seven horse, seven race, hey, show show. What? Hey, pal, what's going on? Not too much. How are you? I'm good. Want to walk and talk? Sure. Tommy, give me a call if my big buddy calls. Tell him I went out to get some fresh air. No problem. Ridiculous. I'm a grown man walking around like a chump. I'm sorry about this. Hey, no problem. So you're a friend of Ray's? <laughs> A friend? Oh, I do some work for him. No, I mean a friend. I don't understand. Whatever you say, he's the slime ball, but uh, he pays. <laughs> sure, pal, sure. Listen to me. The thing about Ray is, he's a good earner. He talks a lot of shit, but he's a good earner. That be. He's a rat. Doing an impression of a man. <laughs> That's pretty good. Phil! Phil! What? What? What do you want? <coughs> Mr. Boss, said you gotta head down to docks. Emergency. Said you'd understand. Ah, oh, shit. It's three days early. Man on the meal. What am I gonna do? What's the problem? Nico, I'm gonna have to take a chance with you, pal. Okay. Come on, let's go. Chances. Yeah. Okay, listen. There's a truck waiting for us. It's under the overpass off Catskill Avenue. Drive us there. You scared this thing for bucks? No, but we can be pretty sure it's clean. Chill out. All right, all right. It's just that if we get caught on this one, you and me is going down for a long time. And that means that certain people is going to assume we're rat, which means we'll get whacked. You're working with the wrong people if you expect them to whack you if you go inside. Where's the trust, Phil? It's about survival. If someone who knew what I knew got flipped, then the whole organization will go down. Whacking someone who catches some heavy time is just an insurance policy. And it don't help that not everyone in the organization is pulling in the same direction. You mean that someone in the family would see someone else going inside as an opportunity to get ahead? You're a smart guy. Anyways, excuse me if I want to be absolutely sure that we got our asses covered. You're excused. What are we doing? We're taking a load of product off of some Russians, the enchiladas have been dealing with. You was helping those Irish idiots cause some beef between the enchiladas and their Albanian muscle a while back. Since that little love affair ended, they've been getting this Russian guy to supply them with sea. We just got the heads up that a shipment has arrived in Liberty City by boat. That's what the talk about the docks was. Exactly. We're taking the sea off the Russians so they can't deliver it to the enchiladas. Sounds straightforward. We take the coke so that the Russians and the enchiladas have a falling out. Then we make some money in the process by selling the stuff. 
Is it? Oh shit! You sound like you're saying all this just so it's clear on the wiretap. For the record, I don't know what this man is talking about. We're rehearsing a scene for an acting class. I work in waste management. Everything we're saying is fiction. It has no... All right, this is the truck. <laughs> I'll just leave it parked in the middle of the building. Perfect. Why do we need this truck? There must be a shitload of coke we're taking. It should be a lot of sugar. But that ain't the only reason why we're taking this truck. Some of my boys stole it from the enchiladas this morning. It's the one the Russians are expecting to come pick up the seat. We should be able to turn up and have them loaded up for us. Then we drive away, no questions asked. I don't know if anyone will give away a load of coke without asking any questions. Even the Russian coke runners ain't that stupid. Yeah, sure, this is just plan A. It's the one Jimmy P worked at. You and me know it ain't gonna work. And that the only way we're gonna be able to leave that place with the sugar is if all the Russians in there are dead. So why don't we use a more subtle approach? Not just drive right into the middle of it. Because these is the orders and we gotta follow them. That's the way things work. You ain't gonna be happy about everything you get told to do, are you? You're the boss. It ain't like I'm working for free. No, you ain't. And I ain't either. That's why we gotta at least try to do what we're told to do. You're gonna learn that there ain't much in this life that you got control of. Whether you're putting yourself in harm's way because that's the way the skipper wants it done, or you're staying away from your kids because of a stupid court order and a malicious bitch of an ex-wife. There ain't that much control in anything. Everybody dialed enough to know that there's some things that we don't have a choice oh my about. God. But there's other times where you got to look at something and make a decision for yourself. I can't follow every order I'm given. Yeah, well, maybe you're right. Maybe you ain't. I don't know. Dead! No! We need voiceover Pete to help her. With your help, we can bring Nico back, back from the, the car dead. number, the eight dudes in the back. Piece of shit! What is this shit? My car! It would be hilarious if there was actually a kid out there that did that. Move! I've, I've seen some dumbass kids, and yeah, they do that shit, where they just steal their parents' credit card, and, like, well, how much, how much of an asshole of a kid do you have to be? Yeah. Yeah. Parents' credit card. The answer is yeah. I don't say you're obligated, because you're not. Who the fuck are you? You're, you're a fucking child. I'm a child. Do you think the kid knows that? The kid should, should know it. Kids are sociopaths. They're like adults. They're like reptiles. <laughs> they are reptiles. Except they're warm blooded. Yeah, this is it. Keep a cool head and everything should be fine. <laughs> yeah, they slither around. They make messes everywhere. Any biologist that just so happened to watch this, we don't care. <laughs> they're just like, these fucking idiots. I'm sorry, Parker, are you greasy? Yes. It is now literally embedded with grease. <laughs> That's probably what happens by other people. Tire iron recently! Effective! <laughs> Hold your... Hey, buddy! We're here to pick up the shipment? I don't speak English! Fuck off! Hey, amigo, let's make this easy. I just want to give the stuff to my boss and go home. I don't let anyone in here until I get the word. There's something wrong about you. <laughs> get out of the truck real slow. Nico, looks like we're gonna have to do this the old-fashioned way. Shoot these commies. Yeah! I've been playing for 
two hours straight. <laughs> two hours and four minutes. <clears throat> there's there's so much grease on this controller now. Yep. Take the last one because this is my house. Yeah, it's your off. Understandable. Okay, listen, there's a truck waiting for us. It's under the overpass off Catskill Avenue. Drive us there. Shit, you seen any choppers? Any birds been in the sky? I didn't think look for a helicopter exist. Fuck you, I ain't. I just keep thinking these choppers is following me, that's all. The feds are watching my every move. I flip out even when I'm outside. Give your head. Things ain't even started yet. What are we doing? Taking a shipment of coke from some Russians before they can sell it to the enchiladas. I'm paranoid on things we especially don't want to get caught. We get caught and everyone will be coming after us. The feds will throw away the key. The Russians and the enchiladas know we was fucking them over. Our own family might come after us, but here we'll turn Why you agree with me? Hey man, this familiarity is kidding. I'm a friend of Ray. I'm part of the family. I'm just the hired help. I'm the fucking immigrant maid cleaning up your guy's shit. I ain't part of no family. I'm an independent contractor. Sure, sure, I get that. Whatever makes it all make sense in your head. Family's a way of saying we ain't gonna fuck each other. At least that's what it's meant to me. All I care about is that you're loyal enough to get the jobs done and not turn state. I'll get the jobs done if the money is there. Oh my god, you said two of the Enough governments have let me down in the past. I don't know why I trust this one. That's the attitude. These guys promise you a new life if you screw every person who ever did a kind thing. Like a then they ship you off to Ohio and get you selling my noodles. What kind of analogy is that? The only cannolis you're gonna see are the ones that It's all into it. It's all dreaming about me. It ain't no life. The band tell you the fuck says that about a noodle. Well, never tried. Oh, there goes the hood. The hood. Where, have you ever tried grabbing a wet noodle? noodle? Yeah, I have. You know how fucking easy it is? Alright, this wet. is Look at this guy over here, just grabbing wet noodles all the time. He's like a professional. <laughs> Fuck off! <laughs> I am a professional wet noodle grabber, you fucking cock. Hey, we're taking an acting class here. None of this is true, none of this is real. They're speaking into the wire. They're gonna let us take the coke with this truck then, are they? That's the plan. Whether it works or not remains to be seen. You know, so I would have liked Ray to be on this job instead of me. There's some things that he ain't trusted with. I don't think I'd trust him to send me on another job after the shit he had to do. After all of that, you guys didn't even get the diamonds. That wasn't a successful operation by any way you look at it. I'm hoping that this endeavor is going to be more fruitful. For the record, I did everything I was meant to do. The problem was Ray's planning and the amount of people involved. Too many people wanted that ice. No one was ever going to win. Well, a lot of people want to get a hold of this merchandise as well. By your logic, that means it's going to end up dissolving into the Humboldt River. Oh, road. Man, maybe, get in the other lane. maybe if we wanted more than uh, anyone uh, else, uh, we'll be uh, able to... Okay, the other lane is not... 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 He's a greedy rat. He wants to stop more than anyone else. He's got his eyes on my position. The skip is too, I'm sure. Wanting it and getting it are two different things, though. Every move he makes is so obvious. It's disgusting to see him trying to squeeze his way up the ladder. His moves might be easy for you to see, but maybe they're working.